All right, boys. Hopefully this is uh this is working. We'll see if Minecraft pops up on there. Are you kidding me? Oh. Oh, it did work. All right. And let's put this like that. Yep, it is working. All right. <laughs> right now we got one person. Pretty good. Pretty. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> All right, we're going to minimize that. Yeah, that doesn't work. Um. Yeah. All right. So we're gonna get into <coughs> an episode. All right. <laughs> so we got our house here. All right. So thinking of completing our house, and I'm thinking. I don't know what resource to use. Hey, yo, yo, type in the chat what resource to use. I'll do any resource. Tell me what to do. I'll do it. Let's get the stream going. Oh, we got two going. Alrighty. Thank you all for, uh, you know, bearing with me in this, you know, technical difficulties here. But, hey, it's working now, so that's always good. <laughs> okay, stop it. <laughs> An actual resource. <laughs> don't say anything I'm gonna go get some uh I'm gonna go on an adventure find like some birch oh yeah I know where birch is I'll go get some birch oh yep I'm gonna go get some birch where's my ooh we might want to wait till nah we're gonna be adventurous oh wait we should chop down the trees first no no Birch comes first. Well, yeah, we definitely got a big, uh, big open area that we can do stuff in. <coughs> Let me jump. No, it's not a jungle. Well, I'm blind. <laughs> Traveling away. I'm done. I'm done with my island. I don't want that anymore. Found this. Oh, this spruce wood up there. Well, oh wow! I already see a lot of a uh, lot of monsters here. All right, I'm thinking we hop in. We get oh my god! Oh wow! Oh wow! Oh oh! Die! I know I'm gonna die. Oh god! I'm gonna die. some hype in the chat cuz I'm a, I'm about to cry here that was that was sad and now we got to go back yo give me give me that no not a birch boat oh my god all right time to go back i want my stuff back that was a stream coming along <laughs> Get some apples. I'll get my apples. Don't worry about it. First, I want to get my stuff back. Should probably make an iron store sword, but hey, I don't know. 
Let's go in here, kids. Yeah, so we got all these islands too. Oh, I can see through the map there. Cool. Um, okay, I'm gonna get my stuff and come out here because there's birch trees and I'm gonna have skeletons like ready to kill me. I don't know where the skeleton is, but I'm out. Like I'm scared. He's gonna come up and kill me again. All right, what's happening? Okay, cool. What is that? Oh my god. What the hell? Okay. Alright, I already got my stuff. I'm getting out of here. Nope. Nope. Alright, we got everything. Let's put that there. Alright. That's an interesting way to uh, start off our stream. Alright. Oh ho ho ho. Bop. Oh god, oh god, the leg. Yeah, we can kill him. We can kill him. Oh, we can't. Oh god. Oh my god, there's another one. Stop. Okay, okay. Got that one. Jesus. We're gonna die like 15 times on the stream. By the way. <gasps> oh, Some apple hype in the chat. Alright, we got a sapling. Apple hype in the chat, please. Um, so yeah, hopefully this records well. <coughs> and it's daytime now. Mm. Oh, well, we could have just gone over there and got some, uh, some birch. Well, I'm dumb. Hey, well. You die, and yeah, that, that happens. But hey, let's get some hype in the chat, boys. It's not all bad. At least we got our stuff back. All right. Slab that right in there. Plant some birch trees here. All right. No, I'm gonna do. Check the stream again. <laughs> yeah. It's <laughs> Boy, I got some apples for you. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna eat this or else like I'm gonna die. Alright. Um so yeah, so house here. Got our dank house. I don't think birch might not be the best thing to go with here, but hey, I'll take it. We don't have much to work with. Alright, this ain't, this ain't creative mode. Wow, you will do that. You better give me an apple or else I'm actually going to beat it. It's just, oh wow. Oh wow. I don't want to take that one down really. I'm going to have to, but. And my thing broke. Wow. A way to go. All right. Well, we gotta go get some more. Oh, I should. All right. Next apple we get, I'm keeping. But yeah, we're gonna keep the next apple. Make a golden apple, as they do. Get hyped for that golden apple. Frame an apple on the wall. <laughs> How do you make frames in this game? I don't know the crafting recipe for that. That wasn't out when I started, but like any other thing. I'll figure it out. 
guessing it's probably like sticks or something. Something super easy. Just like five sticks and I don't know, leather or something. Probably like leather is rather than sticks. No joke. Alright, let's get some of this birch here. To complete our house. Man, these birch trees are tall. saying that. There's gonna be some deforestation in the Next apple we get turning into a uh, golden apple. Oh, sugar cane. I'm gonna need that. Right away. Thanks, bud. We get a uh, cow and some chickens and make a cake. That'd be lit. Okay, I don't know what that was, but I heard something there. It's like a hissing sound. Probably just, you know, hear Brian. <laughs> He's always around. Alright, if we can get some hype in the chat, I'll dig straight down. No joke. Once we cr complete this house, I'll dig straight down. Yeah, that'll probably be enough. So, Mother Nature, how about you don't? Got any apples here? <gasps> apple. <laughs> Golden apple I appear to come. Give me that gold. Alright, is it nuggets that I need? Question mark. I need golden bars. Oh my god. What is this? Well, I gotta do this. So I'm gonna need four more gold. Jesus. Well, boys. I guess we're gonna go on a uh, a trip on your favorite rocket ship. What are uh, what are some other games y'all want to see me play tonight? I don't gotta just play Minecraft. I can play anything. I'm just going to keep this one level all the way. Man, we need some more. Yeah, that looks good enough. Hopefully. It's not going to be enough, is it? No, it really isn't. God dang it. I gotta get even more. I'm not making another crafting table. No, 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 no. We ain't doing that. Alright. Wow, I need seven. They're really gonna do this to me. Oh my god. Bro. 
Alright boys, that's our house complete. Oh, we gotta put some torches on it now. <laughs> All right. Just trying to get my work, boys. All right, I'm gonna create a uh, another chest, and then we're digging straight down. ship that apple. Alright, we're gonna bring the torches, this, um, let me make, seven, no, we're gonna need five, no, we're making four. Four picks coming up, boys. Done. Alright. We out here digging straight down. Let's go like a good enough spot. I just realized I don't need any torches for this. Like we're just going down. Damn, I already hear monsters and stuff. strat right guys you dude you can't you <laughs> oh here I'll get some background music playing um oof all right um let's go on YouTube what music you guys want Bob bra sounds all right We'll do a hour long special. We'll just hear Bob Ross in the background. Drag and drop. It's perfect. Hi, I'm Cord Hosenbeck, and I use Wix. Doc I'd like to welcome you to the joy of painting. This is a one hour instruction. Hey, there we go. Step by step, to a beautiful <laughs> painting project. On this tape, hey, we will paint a water. picture which has never been right, seen boys. on the joy so of painting. That's what happens when you dig straight down. And we'll have sufficient time to demonstrate in detail the various steps and procedures <sighs> used to create individual effects. Nice. All right. Think of this tape as a private lesson in my studio. So and I reserve this front row seat just for you. Um, to start off, I suggest you get a tall yeah, glass what of you guys ice, want me set to, back, and what do you guys want me to in do? its entirety before you begin painting. Say some stuff in the this chat way, you will have a preconceived do. idea in your mind of how the painting progresses and how individual effects are achieved. If any procedure is unclear to you, you may run the tape back and see it again to see exactly how a particular effect was made. Pay 
close attention to the way tools are loaded to achieve certain effects, <laughs> a great deal of the magic occurs right here on the palette. Take your time and work at your own pace. Speed will come with practice. Right, as as I can make this it. is the project we'll be painting today. I think you will find this painting fun as well as an know. excellent learning experience. I strongly suggest that you use this painting only as a guide and add your own ideas to it. We each see nature through different eyes, and your painting should reflect your visions, your personality. Let's Devote see. some time to practice and become familiar with now. each piece of equipment. And very soon, you okay, too so will experience the joy of painting. Before we get started, let's put a complete cool. supply list on the screen, listing all the materials you need to paint this fantastic scene with me. No, no, then I'll be back no, no. in just a second. Golden apple. Yeah, I need. Jeez. I need nine gold. All right, we're going to go. Wait, what happened to Rob Ross? Oh, come on. Get out of here. I want to hear him say titanium white. Titanium white. Titanium white. <laughs> Welcome back. Got all your materials out? Ready to do a fantastic painting with me? Good. Bob, Trees Bob's and good. roads and stones, rocks, hats. For this specific technique, it needs Sorry, pain. a little trick that you can do is take a little bit of liquid black and just put a tiny little bit into your liquid white and it'll give it a, a gray cast. And then when you paint your white canvas, you can tell exactly where it's covered. Okay, long horizontal and vertical strokes just to assure that you have a nice even coating of liquid white over the entire surface. And you're ready to go. Hmm, we can wash your brush. Thank you. And we wash our brushes with odorless paint thinner. And I really, really recommend you use odorless thinner. There's odorless. a screen down here in the Very bottom nice. of this bucket. Scrub the bristles against the screen, the solid material settle to the bottom, and your paint thinner, it remains relatively clean. Shake off the excess, then... <laughs> and that's the fun part of this whole technique. Tell you what, let's make a happy little sky. Yeah, Bob. And for that, I'm gonna go right into it. Really recommend you use odorless thinner. There's a screen down here in the bottom of this bucket. Scrub the bristles against the screen, the solid material settle to the bottom, and your paint thinner, it remains relatively clean. Shake off the excess, then... <laughs> and that's the fun part of this whole technique. Tell you what, let's oh, make a happy nice. little sky. <laughs> and for that, I'm going to go right into a touch of phthalo blue. <laughs> just a little bit. Just pull a little bit of the color out Let's and then go, tap boys. the bristle, bristles firmly into the color. This will right, assure a go. nice, even distribution Let's of paint all the way through the bristles. It does not take much color, just a little. Okay, let's go right up here. Now then, just using little crisscross strokes, again laying in a basic sky. And start at the top and work downward. That way, that way, your brush will pick up the liquid white and automatically, automatically, your color gets lighter toward the horizon. Just let the canvas smoke. work, let the liquid white work, let your brush work. Right, you just enjoy. You just enjoy. Because painting should make you happy. Painting should make you happy. It should be a fun experience. And you can always add a little more color. Start with very little color. You can always go back and add a little more. That's that's very simple. It's a son of a gun to try to take it off, though. You can do it, but it's very difficult. Okay, and that quickly we've laid in a happy little sky. That easy. Okay, now then, all we have is brush dirty. Let's have a little touch of water in this painting. I love water, and it's always fun to do. So I'm gonna take, go right back into my phthalo blue, reach right over here and grab a touch. Just a touch of the phthalo green. Don't need much of that. It's very strong. Just a touch. Phthalo blue and phthalo green. And just tap it into the bristles again. Okay, now decide where you want the water to be and pull from the outside in. Start on the outside, pull in. Start on the bottom, work up. So it gets lighter and lighter toward the horizon. Now see if you start if you start here and go over, it leaves a very distinct line which is hard to blend out. There we go. But you can if you if you happen to forget. But blend from the outside in. 
and leave a little air area open right That's in Jacob's here. Progress. Look like a little sheen of light coming across the water when we're done. Start at the bottom, work upward, let it get lighter and lighter toward the top. Lighter and lighter. Just like Dude, so. You're really, you're really doing it. There we go. Got that titanium white, they little blue. See how easy that is? <laughs> That's all there is to it. <laughs> and then I have several brushes going, and you'll find that saves you a lot of time and a lot of a lot of money and wasted paint if you have several brushes. If you have one for dark color and one for light, otherwise your good paint's going to end up down here in this washer bucket. Okay, clean brush, and I'm just going to blend right across here, very lightly. I don't want to lose this light area, but I just want to bring it all together, just like so. Okay. And that's ready. Hey, you all fixed up. This now, if you just have a you tiny bit of paint, paint on your brush, hard. you can just that wrap it like that, and it takes, it'll takes it take that paint off. Okay, let's use the fan brush today. We'll build a happy little cloud. Let's go right into titanium white. And I'm going to reach down here, be right back, get the least little touch, a little bit more of the bright least red. touch. I want to put a little sunlight in these clouds. I want to make a happy little cloud today. Happy little cloud. Let's make a happy okay. little cloud. Decide where your cloud lives. Maybe he lives right in here. Take the corner of the brush and just make tiny little circles. Tiny little circles, round what and round and round. Don't stay in one place and keep working. Don't stay in one place if you just stay in one place here and, and keep grinding the paint, you're going to end up with big cotton balls up in the sky. Now you can also do this just as well with a one-inch brush or, or two-inch brush. Two-inch brush makes fantastic clouds. Okay, now with a clean, dry two-inch brush, use the top corner of the brush, and you want to blend just the base of these clouds out. Not touching the top yet, just blend. See, very lightly, very, very lightly. Just like so. Yeah, I think we got here about Barely, here. barely okay. blending. Okay, now we're going to fluff it, and this, we're going to do a big circular pattern. So grab yeah, it gently good. and fluff it upward. Just, just fluff it. See. And you're going to pull up little stringy things when you do that. Don't worry about them, because when you go across, they just go away. They just go away and that's easy. Across. You have Let one there, beautiful little cloud. And maybe we'll, maybe we'll put another happy little cloud in here. Maybe this other cloud, maybe he lives right over here. Same thing, tiny little circles. And just drop him in wherever you think he should live. He lives right there. He lives right there. And in your world, wait, wait, you put wait, a cloud where you want it. Live. You don't necessarily need to put a cloud where I do. Right there, you put boys. it where you think. Right where it if you think it, it lives somewhere else, then that's where it ought to be. There we go. Lift it gently, lift it, and very lightly just go across it. And that easy. Don't we be got another happy little cloud right it. there. No. Absolutely no just problem. perfect. Man. Okay, wipe off the old fan brush. And I just have some paper towels over here. Why the the dirt is on. On. What is that noise? Can we get a replay on that? Wipe it off and we're in business. Hold on. Let's okay, I'll wipe off the old fan brush. Can I turn this up for a second? Some paper towels over here that I cleaned the brushes on. Okay. Wow, Bob. Didn't know you were that type of man. Business. Let's build maybe oh, wait, back I in here. There's just a too small little mountain over there. So let's take a touch of Prussian blue. Prussian blue. A little blue. bit of uh, midnight black. We're going to get a little touch of a lizard crimson. Oh, got so got got five watching. All right. Blue, black. This is kind of maybe a little bit of that I can't like find some gold. That oh, gold and apple. Dark colors. That we dream of. Okay, pull the paint out as flat as you can get it. Just really mash down hard. Then take your knife and cut across. Cut across. See, get that little roll of paint. Make this knife has a straight across. edge on it. Bob, and come on. By having a straight edge, it's, it's very easy to load it. Let's go on up here. Okay. And then maybe, maybe our little mountain. I gotta make a big decision here. Maybe he lives right here. Just floats around oh, in the clouds. Just nothing. Push very firmly. 
very firmly. We're trying to push this color right into the fabric. And you just decide where you want little bumps to live. See, there's one. Wherever. Oh, wait, no. Wherever you want them. Maybe there's a happy little thing that's right there. Hey. <laughs> scrape off all the excess Let's paint. Go. Just Boys. really get in there and scrape oh, off. Cave. You can't hurt this. Just scrape it off. The only thing we're worried about is this nice the outside only edge. Thing in here, I'm worried we could about care less. Now then. Okay, there's four. Two inch brush. Oh my I god. Grab yeah, this. Golden apple boys. And because of the liquid white, the canvas is wet. You can pull this and move it. And just move it. Any on, Remember? Any on you can see the entire mountain. Uh, there's always no distinct at the top than it is at the bottom. But and boys, we're doing this we're getting that, that will happen apple. automatically. It's happening. It is happening. Just like so. See, just let it sort of oh float my god, off in the sky. Oh, nope, 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 go. nope, skeletons, no. Because this is a very firm no. paint, you can blend right over it. Okay, no. now then, maybe there's some, maybe there's some snow on that little mountain. So we can take some titanium white, and once again, pull it out. As flat as you can get it, just really pull it out. Then go pull across, down. get that pull little roll of paint. So white. Tiny little roll of paint, let's go up here. Okay, now that right, right let's, along uh, here. Let's make Take this the point of the knife, put it right up at the top iron. of the mountain. Let's make some no pressure. armor. Just let it keep on dying. Float. I don't know why you float guys, right down, down like the side of the mountain point. there. Uh, no pressure. Very fine. See? Follow the angles in the mountain. Okay. Absolutely right. no pressure. Okay, maybe right here. I put this in there. Think where well, light would strike. Build another furnace. Then. Think where the sun would shine through here create all these beautiful little effects. And if you're right-handed, it's normally easier for the light to come from the right side. Normally easier. See? Very delicate yeah, touch, though. That's what's going. Very it's delicate. Oh, it does. Very, very delicate. This is a time when the little knife would come in even better. So you can get back here with a little yeah, knife and get these little places. Well, that's the the gun just sneaks right in Jeez, there. Bob. Either knife works very well. Well, they both <laughs> come have back the straight come edges and they work very good. Take a little bit of blue and white. This is a little phthalo blue. Just a touch. Just a touch. Mix it up about like so. That's good. Cut across, and once Cut again, across, we have that boys. small roll of paint right out on the edge of the knife. So you can see it's right on the end. There you go. Now then, decide. Dude, it's Which peaks run. farthest run away? If this one's in the background, watching. put a shadow Don't behind me. this one first. Just a little tiny shadow. There's a shadow here. It's here burning. Let it come down. All right, guys. Distinctly through. See there? We got it. Distinctly through. We got the golden apple. Golden oh, apple. Think in your mind that the it's only thing like touching boys. the canvas is that little tiny hey, roll of paint. An frame? And each little highlight needs a shadow. If it doesn't have a shadow, it won't come out and play I with really you. It'll just leave you. Just leave you stranded. Okay, now then. Sometimes it's fun to play some games. All right, need leather. All right. So clean dry brush. Now. I'm going to tap the base of this following the angles. I want to create mist. Now lift. Upward, very softly. Suck. What are you talking Three hairs about? Of air over here. Follow mm -hmm. these angles. Want me to die right away. Left, left, blend. See, it just softens that center gun right down there. Okay, now then. Maybe. So you can change maybe your mind. Now, maybe there's a, a peak that lives right here. And if we want to make this one look Boys. like it's in front of that by diffusing that first and then bringing then a line distinctly to, down. Uh, you know, It'll cover up push all that back. Shadow. But that little misty area is the only thing that separates hey, those. you know what? I'll take so it. So cherish it. It's your good friend. Nice. Maybe this. Shoot, look here. Definitely look nice. You can take this anywhere you want it to go. Maybe a lot of our trees have grown. Anywhere you want all it to right. go. But notice Where all the angles of highlight or light color are like in the same basic direction. Same basic direction. 
Cause what lights only want to strike. At a given you. angle, coming through yeah. here, sing. Pretend you're a sunbeam, just wandering around here and I'll having fun. Put all my stuff in here, but they have Okay, one. now we need a shadow so back here. Yeah. Everywhere there's a highlight. We have to have a shadow, just a little shadow. Up, up. Just a little happy shadow that lives right back here. See how that pops right out? Comes your friend. Where's this happy shadow you're talking about? It's easy. Just a few little rules. Mountains are just geometric shapes. Highlights and shadows. Oh, you eat the apple. And you can make some of the most fantastic do I eat mountains the apple? you've ever seen. Or do I put it in a frame? What's great, ex great for practice and get to give you experience is just take a canvas and start at the top and mountains here. from top to bottom. This campfire one And you can learn good. more. Oh, it's it's a super oh, way to this, practice. This ain't, this ain't Bob. And by the time you're finished, it's you'll be this. good friends with a knife. Okay, tapping the base, following those angles again. Now, you want to save that one line right there. That's a distinct line that separates these two entities. Save that. Step upward very gently. Whisper light. You don't want to destroy, you just want to diffuse. Over here, follow these angles. Save this line. That's a distinct line that oh, you man, need. Sure keeps going. Give it a little blend. Hype for you. And you've got one very effective, All right, we're gonna yet go very easy little mountain. I knew you could do it. We're gonna make it entirely. Tell you what, let's have some little footy hills that live right in here. It's gonna be that, a farming island. This island let's mix here. up some color. We're gonna import shoot. We'll over take. There. We had this mountain that color. Right there. That was just some Prussian blue and some midnight black. Prussian we'll put blue, some Van Dyke black. brown, lizard and crimson. Just a little touch of sap green. Don't want too much sap green. I'm gonna reach over here and find some white. How do I do that? I can't even and see that. How am I doing? See this? what we got here. You gotta put a little white with it to know pink. what you have. It's very difficult to I tell. All the a little more blue in there. Lines. Oh yeah. Just sort of play with the color till it gets like you want it. I'm looking for a color that Sort of a bluish gray, maybe with the least little hint of green. It's too far away to have much green. That color okay, then we can lift it up like so. Okay, let me clean the knife. And today, I tell you what, let's do. Let's use a one-inch brush, and I'll just go right into that and just pull it through, just to load a little paint on it, like so, just like so. Okay, let's go up to the canvas. Now Extreme. you have to make a big decision here. Where's your little foothills live? Maybe let's we'll start right in here. Maybe, Maybe just use your corner of the brush. Even more. Maybe they just come right down. He's already, he's already like top there deer. There they come. Wherever you want them. And just pull it. sort of pull it straight down. Turn it over and use the other corner. If one gets gets empty, you can turn it over. Just pull straight down. Straight down. But but very important here. See this little misty area right in here? You want to save that mist that's between the foothills and the mountain. If you if you kill that misty area, these foothills are going to look like they're right up against the mountain. You don't want that. Okay. I don't know what Bob yeah, so well. Time to wash the brush. I've put off washing the brushes so I'm about to run out. Good shape. Oh and just God, beat the devil out there. Now, right, I want to create mist at the base of this foothill. So, here, all we're going to do, and pay attention, pay attention here to the angles. This foothill is going to sort of be coming down this way. Oh my God, and just Jagger. like so. Jeez, Bob Ross, Bob Ross must be blessing there we us. Go. See how soft that makes the base of that little sun I've got to look. Now give it gentle little upward lifts. Gentle, gentle, gentle. All right. Now then, maybe we'll put one coming down this way. Same color, only darker. Same color, only darker. So, as things get closer to you in the landscape, you they should get darker house. in value. Little darker what in type the house? They get closer. You want me to go modern, or you want me and to? And you just mix these colors on your brush. Shoot, no big deal. A little green in there. Do the one, boys. Not much green. Oh it's too God, far I away. Another okay. apple. And maybe apples are gonna be my. Maybe this one lives. 
Might as well get it here somewhere. We'll be eating up. There he goes. There he goes. See, this one's a little darker, so it'll stand out. Now, sometimes you want to make something that looks like a little individual trees. You can just take a brush and turn it on the end, see? And pull down, and it makes a little more distinct things. Depending on the effect that you want to achieve. Can I, oh no, I can't wait to get me so Maybe this comes right in there. You just sort of have to make a big decision and decide oh, where it lives. Around, yeah. Look at there. It's that easy, though. And I'll show you, show you something that's fun here. Maybe you decide in here, maybe there's a little separation, and this one comes right on down here. See, you can. You can sort of pull them apart and make more than one that easy. And you just take them wherever you want them to go. Go. I'm in a super way though, just to make some, some happy little foothills that live back here in the distance. Maybe over here this one comes up a little. I don't know. It's eating like spaghetti. Whatever you think. All right, boys. Whatever you think. You just put them in. Get a golden apple here. Okay. Now then, with our two-inch brush, still paying should attention to the lay of the land, or should I go to a different island? we can sort of begin tapping this, just wherever you think it should go. So I feel like we should keep this house here. There. Go make another house somewhere. Don't want to destroy this little line, though. If we're going to keep that in, we'll go in between there and just tap with a corner of the brush to soften. Like so. Okay, then short little strokes, silence. lift oh. straight up. Even if this comes down the hill, lift it straight up. Straight up, straight up, straight up. Always. Straight up, dude. If you lean it to the side and lift, it'll look like a little tree's far away. Look like the wind's blowing a thousand miles an hour and about to blow them away. There, straight up. Straight up. There we go. All right, and then very the location. Just blend it. Which location you want to do it at? We can. I'm thinking, okay. but in that one super way to, to make some happy little foothills, we disconnect it from and they're that easy. This that easy. Tell you um, what, let's do. Let me find our, uh, there it is. Make our new house over here. There it is. Right by the <laughs> trees. Can't find my brush, you know. Nope. When you get old, the mine's the second thing to go. Or we make our house. Okay, we'll take some of that dark color. We'll use some black, right. some blue. One chat for this place. Want this to be mm -hmm. very, very dark. Over black that, and blue. We'll get some. Know? Little brown, little sap green. So this should look black. It should be so dark. Now pull this brush through the paint, and as you pull it through, wiggle it. See, wiggle it, and then sharpen it. That'll bring the brush to a super sharp <laughs> chisel edge. You really have wasted an hour. Super sharp edge. There you can see it. it's very sharp. Oh hey, the, the only reason it's sharp is because you have oh. so much paint in there. It's literally just stuck the bristles together. Okay, now then, maybe back in here, way back in the distance, there's some little evergreens that live. Now, the only way to make these One show is to save this little misty this area. So touch it with this, that, that nice I chisel edge. See here? Don't Which kill that little misty that area that's in between. And every so often, reload your brush to bring it back to a nice sharp edge. You don't want to see how far And you can begin down. dropping in all kinds of just happy little distant trees. We're not looking for distinct Bob shape yet. Picture, too, far too far away still. Too far away. When they get closer, then we'll worry about individual shapes. Right now, all we're trying to do, there, just, just sort of tap. Hmm, isn't that fun? Dang, Bob. It's a super little way on. to make a lot of trees. Now, if you get them too far apart, you, let's just do some here. See, if you put them like this, they're very rapidly going to look like telephone poles or fence posts. If that happens, just put some more in there. Just means you don't have quite enough. Not quite enough. There we go. So reload your brush frequently. And maybe as they wander out here, they get a little bit Can bigger. Can you guys hear me good? Or no? And by making them bigger out here, and smaller toward the center, it'll create the illusion of a little pond here. You'll see what I mean in just a second. 
but sort of let them get bigger toward the outside edges, and it makes a wonderful effect. A wonderful really effect. Lucky to all these islands, Make you happy, and if you're interested in selling paintings, <laughs> what we got? that's Green what'll sell them. Trees. Okay, now, it doesn't matter if a little bit of that water. color comes down, because we're going to have water, so this will just end up being just happy little reflections. There we go. But now, one of the things when you're painting, right. the more planes you have in a painting, you know the more what? depth, the more distance go with that here. you'll have. We're gonna go back Your painting will look deeper. So, come right up here. Now, look, look up close. Let me show you. Look at all the planes that we have here. This one right here, where these dark trees, and then this, and this one, another one, and then you have several different planes in the mountain. Now, oh, yeah. if you can zoom mountain. back a little bit and take a look, see, when you look at all these planes independently, look at the, right there, look at the oh, depth that's the in that already, and it's caused only because of all the of these various planes in your painting. Far. And that's, that's what'll, <laughs> that's what'll make a happy buck. Now then. Let's create some reflections right here. Let's take a two inch brush, decide where you want reflections to be, grab and pull straight down. Because these trees are short, just have short reflections here as you work outward. Okay. Let them get a little longer. Trees are a little taller, reflections okay, a little longer. You want to go face See off there? The skeleton. Go out the other way, just pull straight down now. Straight oh, down. Missed. Oh, you can do super damage to us easy, now. nice way to make fantastic reflections. Oh, yeah. And nice. you can do it. You can do it. And very lightly, very lightly, come straight across. And instant reflections. Show you another little trick. You gotta get some iron. This is fun. So, uh, Maybe you want to create another plane in here. You can do that iron. simply by just bridge. taking a little. Oh. Doesn't matter as long as it's a light color. We just whatever happens to be on the palette. Now watch right in here. Maybe you want to show a little, another little plane. Touch here with a fan brush and lift upward. It'll make it look like little tree trunks far away, but it also begins creating the illusion of another plane in the paint. You don't care plane Minecraft. You just want paint. Looks like a little bank back here, and it also looks like little tree trunks. Hundreds of little tree trunks. Isn't that sneaky? And the more of these you put in, better to look the more planes that you have in your painting. Now if you get one here that you don't like or it's too bright, all you have to do is work it in work it in and all that dark color back there will eat it up. Let's build all a little water light. Will eat it up. For that, I'm going to take a touch of a liquid white and put it on my palette. Liquid white. Liquid white, Bob. But what about titanium? Just white? pull it out and then lightly cut across. That's all there is to it. See, there's a little bit of paint right up on the top here. Oh, oh my god. Use a firm oh pressure. No. And all we're going to do is just cut in the water alive. line. Use a firm to keep these lines basically straight. Oh my god. Basically straight. I'm shaking right See now. There? Just cut in a happy little water line. Wherever you think they should oh. be. Do Wherever they should be. How do we do that? There we go. Okay. And it's super, and you can do it. You can do it. See now a few little ripples here and there on the water. They too need to be straight. <laughs> if they're not straight, the water look like it's going to run right Dude. out of your painting. Do I eat my a lot apples? of problems? Oh my God. Okay. Tell uh, you what. Tell you let's what. go. Let's begin putting that some foreground in here. Though. Let's take a big bunch of the Prussian blue, black, brown, oh, I, I don't know, crimson, sap green, <laughs> it doesn't matter. Whatever you have, shoot, just drop it in there. Dark colors, dark colors. There we go. Look at that. Might as well mix up a big wad of paint. Okay, let me clean off the knife. So let's continue. Today, tell you what, tell you what, let's do. Let's use, oh shoot, we'll God. just use an old two inch brush. You could. You could do this with a fan brush, a uh, one inch brush, it doesn't matter. I'll use a two inch today. Pull it through the paint, wiggling it. See, wiggle it. Other side, 
pull it through and wiggle it. You need a lot of paint in the bristles, just like with a one-inch brush, to bring it to a nice sharp chisel edge. Wiggle it, that loads the brushes, the bristles, I mean, loads the bristles. And by wiggling it and pulling it, it pulls the paint toward the end of the bristles and sharpen it, just like you would a knife. Okay, look at how sharp that sharp is. Boy, that yes. Son of a gun, it's just, you could shave with it. Look at that, super sharp. Do now then, <coughs> no, 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 let's decide. Maybe there's a happy tree, I mean, evergreen tree. tree. He lives right there. Start with just touching the canvas. Use just the corner of the brush, just the corner. This cave is sketched. And begin pushing, making the bristles bend more. slightly downward. Can't believe See that? Found, found diamonds yet. A little bit. A little Look bit at that. Isn't that a nice that. little tree? And he lives right here in this brush. All you have to do is sort of push him out. Each time you start a new evergreen, reload the brush to a nice sharp chisel edge. Go through the same procedure. Let's oh, have wow. another one. Maybe he lives All right, right cool. there. Just make a decision and drop him in. Hey, let's go, boys. Wherever you want him. Make there he goes. Yeah. There he goes. One of the questions I get asked quite frequently, I what happens to a tree getting messed and decide up. I don't like him? Like or maybe I'll make him taller. Watch here, watch here. Okay, Let's say, well, I hate to mess up his tree, but I want to show you this. It's a good tree. tree. No, maybe I'll make his tree taller. All you have to do is touch wheat. and come right back over the top of him. See here? And you just so paint a bigger tree apples. right over the top. I can't do that all the time. We don't make mistakes. We have happy accidents. Happy accidents. And you have a brand new, beautiful tree. Well, that easy. Things, mistakes, only happy accidents. Tell cool. you what, let's do. Let's have a tree on the other side too. Bring the brush back to a chisel edge. Mistake. Nice and sharp. Okay. And maybe this tree. Make this old tree. Maybe he goes almost all the way to the top of the canvas. Oh, same way. This will give you some practice using a big brush. Some beautiful little evergreens. My boys this might be my favorite hearts. brush to do this with. Not one of these. It's so much fun. So, so often we avoid this brush because it's big, but it'll do some of the most beautiful little delicate things. See? Just you're pushing downward with the corner of the brush, just the corner. Just the corner. As you work down the tree, you push harder and harder, yeah, so you're actually using like more of the brush. Like but just the corner and push down. Congrats for that. See, down. I'm exaggerating now so you can see down. Down. Like that. Okay? Now then, maybe down. we'll have Hold some on. leaf trees in there. So pull the brush in one direction through the paint. One okay. direction. Okay. Loaded full of color. One direction. This is the same old dark color. Really pull it. Pull it. By pulling it in one direction, it'll generate a, a round corner. See, you pull it, and then that corner is round. We're going back. When we touch the canvas, we want that rounded corner toward the top. Let's go right up here. That I didn't know this one. <coughs> Maybe right here lives a nice tree. We're coming and swinging, boys. A nice tree lives there. Just push, bend the bristles upward. That rounded corner was toward the top. Just push and bend it upward. Okay, you have to make some decisions now. Where does this live? Let's say it comes right out here. Right out here, like so. Whatever. Whatever. This is your world. You make the big decision. That was so much fun. Let's go over here. Maybe on this side. Maybe there's a tree lives right in here. See, we don't have to separate these yet. We separate them with highlights. Right now, all we need are just basic shapes. See, just push, bend that brush up. And when you do it, don't let the brush slide like that. See the difference? You get They're those. Gone. They are Makes gone. good swamp grass. We're not after that right now. Just push. There we are. Diamonds. And you just, wherever you want them. You can begin filling all that in. It's just the map with just no diamonds spawn. Good place to practice bushes and stuff right in here. Wow. Excellent, excellent place to practice.
Yeah, we've got got all that color blocked in. That easy. Maybe nice individual bush lives right there. Okay. Now then, let's make a few tree trunks here and there. And to do that, we'll take a little of the dark sienna, a little Van Dyke brown, and some white. Lovely. Yeah. Just pull it out very flat. Don't overmix. Leave it. Leave it marble like that. Cut across. Get that little roll of paint. All those various colors will be in that little roll out here. It's all there. See there? Okay. Now yeah, then, we'll go right up in here. Just touch. Allow the canvas to pull off what it wants. Give it just the least little pull to the side. And you can put in just a happy little tree trunk wherever you want. That easy. Maybe in this big tree over here. Here's a little trunk. You don't have to show the entire trunk because the leaves are going to cover up places. You won't see all of it. Okay, maybe in this tr old tree here, there's a trunk lives. Wherever you want them. Wherever you want them. Another thing, just take a clean knife and scratch through the paint. See, it makes it look like all kinds of little delicate sticks and twigs and Hey, People we got Nick here. For weeks doing this with a little one-haired brush. If you want them to be wider, stronger, turn the knife, and they'll get thicker. And you can put limbs on trees or whatever you want, just doing this. Most of these will be covered up, as I say. Let's put a few on the other side over here. Just here and there. Okay. Now then, over here, let's have some reflections. So take the big brush, decide where you want right, reflections and, and land to meet. Grab Pop. and just pull it straight down. Oh, cool. Straight down. The liquid white is still wet. It stays wet for several days on a good canvas. And the paint will move. And oh, wait, you no, can no, turn no, what no, was no, land right no. into reflections. Right, not turn that, that easy. I don't want to die here. Then go lightly across. I'm going to grab an old one-inch brush here. Now then, let's begin putting some highlights in all these things. I'm going to go right into a touch of the liquid white into yellow. Okay, Turn yellow, boys. reach up here. Be right back. Get a little sap green. Maybe add a little black. Dull it down some. There. You could just use black and yellow. Makes a beautiful you guys green. Can't hear I'm me. looking for a dark green color here. Dark green color. Bring it brush back to a nice, sharp, sharp Not edge. Not at all. See there? Very sharp. Okay. Now then, I want to highlight these big evergreens using just the corner of the brush. Just sneak in here. Yo, why is this? Like why is this got to be such Don't a kill all your dark areas. Okay. So evergreens are Doesn't usually even give quite me a dark. Diamond. So try not to kill all those dark areas. They're, they're important. Especially in evergreens. Okay, a little bit out here on this one. Don't want him left out. That easy. That easy. Okay, let's go over here to this other evergreen. While we're in the evergreen business, shoot, might as well get them all. See there? <laughs> just basically using just the corner of the brush, though. Just the corner of the brush. Not a great deal of pressure. If your paint won't come off your brush, and the least little touch, the least little touch of paint thinner. That'll loosen the paint up and pull it to come off. It'll loosen the paint up. And then paint will stick to a thick paint. Okay. And then we'll wash that brush off real quick. Keep oh! Good shape. And off we go. Now we can begin Got working the on the trees. Bob Ross here. Back into the liquid white. Good let's go right through some yellow. I think we're and just a touch of green. I want this to be a this nice shiny green. Go. And your world, you make it whatever color you want, okay? Just want to show you how to create the effects. Pull that brush in one direction and get it full of paint. There's a lot of paint in there. The secret to this is to have a lot of paint so you just have to barely touch the canvas. If you have to hit the canvas firmly or hard. All right, we're done with Bob here. All right, actually.
actually we're gonna go here all right can you hear can you guys hear me now let me know if you can hear me just want to figure out you know if you can actually hear me um and it was just a bob ross problem or if I actually have to adjust my audio. I'll even turn down my game volume. Alright, boys. Yo, get some, get some, let, let's do some Q&A here. Get some questions in the chat. I'll answer, I'll answer your questions. How about that? Because we don't, we don't, we don't got uh, you know Bob Ross going anymore, so we gotta get something. All right, found some redstone. That's that's always something. We'll get all the redstone. Sometimes around redstone is diamonds, but it don't look like it. Dang, this is just diamond deficient map. took away all the diamonds from this map. Yo, I don't know when we're supposed to be done here. Have we reached the end yet? Nice. Alright, well, I'll go back. There we go. Another pick. Alright. When are you gonna collab with PewDiePie? Um, well, you know, it really depends. You know, I mean, I'll uh, I'll email him and everything, but it really depends on you know when when he gets back to me and if he if he really wants to collab. Like, I mean, I'd I'd be down to do that. You know, help out my channel, maybe try to help him out some way. Um, you know, maybe record a video with him. You know. I, you know, he helps me, I help him, you know, bring a little bit of, uh, hype into his videos, you know, he's not, not too good at the hype game, you know, it takes a certain special hype man to do that, so, that's what I'd say about my, uh, collab with PewDiePie, so, I guess we'll see what happens, boys. Alright, we're definitely going to be playing Minecraft until we find at least one diamond. From that point, um, I'll see what you guys want, and I'll play something that you guys want. Or if you just want more Minecraft, we'll just keep on going with that. Alright, boys. When is Minecraft 2 coming out? Um, you know, Minecraft 2, it's, uh, it's still under development, you know, Notch, Notch really hasn't said anything about it, um, but I know that it's going to be coming out, so I'm, I'm definitely going to be pre-ordering Minecraft 2, um, maybe, you know, maybe we'll add circles to it, man, that'd be, that'd be some weird shit, though add circles to Minecraft. I don't know I don't know how that'd work. All the physics and everything. I feel like it'd sort of be off, you know. Um but yeah, so um as to when my next live stream will be, um I'm hoping to do a live stream probably at a thousand subs, you know? Not a thousand, not a thousand. Probably probably a hundred. Hundred would be a good good goal to do another live stream at. Um, and I hope that the recording of this is working, um, and then I'm going to upload the recording to YouTube so that people can at least, you know, check it out, scrub through the, uh, 
video and everything. Um, so I could also do a uh, stream highlights video. All right, we gotta we gotta find somewhere else to mine or something. I don't know. This just this just ain't working. Let's go all the way down to bedrock. How about that? As to when I'm going to hit diamonds, you know, that's really up to here around here. Because, I mean, I know he's in my game. I've been hearing some weird stuff happening. So, I'd say ask here Brown about that one. Alright, there we go. There's some bedrock there. So, we haven't dug straight down, but it's at least something. Um, what is your stance on women's suffrage? <laughs> Um, you know, there's definitely, you know, women's suffrage, you know, it's, it's something, man. You know, it sucks. Huh. You know, it sucks that they uh, live in a society where they think that, you know, we're constantly just, you know. Oh my god. <laughs> Can we get some hype in the chat, boys? We found it. We found it. Get some hype going. We got the d -d 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 diamonds. Every day I'm mining. Mining. Every day I'm mining. And we got eight diamonds here. That'd be some hype. Oh my god, I think we do. I think we got all eight. We got eight diamonds here, boys. Count them. One. Yeah, give me, give me that achievement. We got eight freaking diamonds. Oh my god. Bop. Can we get some hype in the chat, boys? <laughs> Women's suffrage, it sucks. Yeah, you do. Make a diamond apple, you know. I really wish I could make a diamond apple, but I don't think that's how it works, bud. But yeah, you know, women's suffrage, it uh it sucks, man, you know. That that really blows. But hey. Hopefully it'll get uh, get resolved someday. <laughs> Probably won't though. Judging by who's uh who's the president here. But hey, it's whatever. Alright, we got our first diamond pick. Let's make a diamond sword. Actually, no, let's not make a diamond sword. Diamond pick, though. 10 out of 10. Love it. This thing's a beast. Alright. We're gonna save and quit here. Um, Now, I could play on some servers. Or... Um, we got, oh, Jesus Christ, um, we have a bunch of other stuff, um, so these are all my games, so if you guys want me to play any of these, let me know, and I'll play some, I could also see if, uh, this, if Jupac is on, let me, see if he's on. Let me check Discord real quick. Um, no, I'm, I will not be doing the cha uh, <laughs> Tide Pod <laughs> tide <pot> Challenge. <laughs> God. Oh, man. You're looking at... Yeah, Dylan does want an ear looking ASMR. Alright. He's not in God's house. Um, eat chips in the mic. I don't think I got any chips in the house right now. Um, you guys got any 
any games you want me to play? Any of these? I'd be down to do any of them. Some of them I'd have to download, but... I really... Um, we could do some PUBG just by myself. Um, oh wait. What the fuck is the Sprite and Banana Challenge? That doesn't even sound like a challenge. Yo, you should bring me some eggnog. Dude, I don't got the Sims on this. I'd play the Sims, but I don't got the Sims. Throw up if you drink Sprite and then eat a banana. I'm not gonna buy the Sims. <laughs> Yo, choose choose one of one of these games to play, or just go back to Minecraft. <laughs> Who is Taiwanese Ping Lord? <laughs> what tarnation? <laughs> Mike or Nectar. <laughs> All right, we got one for Mafia. You'll send me a decapitated head if I do. Th if I buy The Sims Three. Want me to do Sudoku? <laughs> Look up Sims 3. This oh, 20 bucks. Buddy, how about no? Um. Hmm. I would play. Alright, we're gonna quit Minecraft. Um Dude, my dog's sleeping right now. I don't got Madden eighteen. Who do you think I am? Um, how about this? Let's play some Sudoku. I'll try to, try to satisfy everyone's needs. So, we'll do some of this. Alright. Um, two, one, nine. So, yeah, so we'll do one round of Sudoku. Um, okay, um, one, two, what can I put there? I can't put anything there. Okay, so this will be nine. This will be two. This will be seven. Hmm. Oh wow, I'm done. I'm dumb. Wow. This has to be six. Um, one, two, three. So we need a four. We need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Bop, there's one more row done. <laughs> All right, 
I don't want to do more of this. All right. Um, <laughs> um, all right, we're going to do some... All right, PUBG or Mafia? You guys choose. PUBG or Mafia. Choose, boys. Not doing solitary. All right, not doing that. All right, we got two for mafia. We are gonna have to start over, so that's gonna suck. Um, actually, we'll probably play a DLC so we can just get right into it. All right, we got two for mafia. I'm gonna play some mafia. Tic tac hoe. Stop. <laughs> All right. Yeah, we're going to be doing Jimmy's Vendetta here instead of the base game. NVIDIA, don't, don't do this to me, NVIDIA. Don't be super loud. <laughs> oh. Alright, there we go. Let me... Empire Base. Alright, there we go. Alright, we're going to do Jimmy's Vendetta. Play it on hard. Swagger, boldness, means mafia. Alright, we're gonna skip this. We're just going straight into it. We're escaping prison, boys. Just like this isn't even mafia. This is just how many people can I kill? All right, nice. So he escapes. Cool. some people yet. Go to gun shop. Sometimes I even impress myself. Shit, I'm good. Dumbass. Mm, you don't 
turn tail now. Set. Oh wait, I'm taking this car. Mind if I borrow your car? Who the hell is this? How about that? Run! Come on, follow me. Here we go. God, why is it? Suspect is about six feet tall, average size. Copy that. Oh, Mind if I borrow your car? Thanks. And we're done. That's how easy the cops can kill you in this. So bad. Alright, how we doing in the stream? Play Russian roulette and do a face reveal. <laughs> Cop won't get down. All right, boys. One time mission. Oh, there we go. I don't want to do a mission right now. Don't mess around. Let's take this. Oh yeah. Feel free to look around. Just what am I supposed to be impressed? Get out! Oh, 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 oh hey! Like what? What? <laughs> Why did they start? They just started going off on me. What did I do? What did I do? To do? All right, we're gonna take this. Fine, we're gonna break it. Okay, well, I probably need morning. Like. I take I can't trust anyone, buddy boy. All right, what do we want here? I'm gonna take just all the suits. Just all the suits. I'm gonna go inside here. Suspect is off. Big boys. 
headshots only here. Oh! I said headshots only. Use extreme caution. Use of automatic weapons is authorized. Cops. I'm not going there with <laughs> cops on my tail. <laughs> Let's go to a gun shop. Now we're gonna go to this gun shop. Sometimes I need to impress myself. In pursuit of a speeding vehicle. Roger that. Some idiot just drove into us. We're bringing him in. Come on. Ten four. Start shooting. That's called uh, gunshot brutality. <laughs> right after talking about woman suffering, shoots a chick point blank in the head. Like JFK. Oh, I think it just did. It, it happened with them boys. I don't know what happened, but somehow <laughs> forget about it. Go watch the stream. Let's go kill this chick again. Why not do it again? Alright, boys. Okay, first things first. What am I supposed to do? You can't bring a gun in here. Go on, get out. There's a chick. Oh, she left. Alright, so. We'll get that. Get this again. Don't be a ah. he gets. It's okay, it's justified. He had a gun too. He saw it.
I'm gonna kill that noise. What did you want to release for the difference? I didn't know. Okay, here, here they come, here they come. Police brutality, police brutality. I'm sorry, but that was some police brutality there. We have four people watching. So I've done most of the stuff. I'm gonna go to the high tier store. Get some money and then we'll go to the high tier gun shop. How does that make sense? Isaac, what is this? What the? <laughs> what is this? <laughs> More Minecraft.
So we got one for Minecraft. Anyone else want anything? Or just do Minecraft? Alright, we're gonna do some more Minecraft then, boys. Get our Mafia. Hop. Alright. this Jupac kid. Actually, thank you Jupac for making me this uh, intro song. It's definitely something. It'll be in my next video. So, thank you for that. Alright, Isaac wants me to show off the intro, so I'll be nice and I'll show it off to everyone. Oh. <laughs> you uh thank you Isaac here for doing that all right so y'all want me to go exploring so that's what I'm gonna go do still sending me okay we're not gonna be <laughs> looking at that that's how to get demonetized or actually that's how to get monetized and then demonetized because of this video Thanks, bud. Alright, so... thing about this. We don't have any food. So, I'm going to be bringing along a furnace and coal. So that uh, we'll be able to cook food once we kill animals. Because, you know, circle of life and everything, you know? It's just, it's got to... It's got just has to happen, man. I'm sorry. Alright. Bop. Alright, so we'll get eight. Bring like twenty one coal. Alright. Well, I'm ready to go exploring. So let me um let me write down my coordinates here. Cause I don't wanna I don't wanna lose them. So X is negative two forty two. Z is one nineteen. All right, let's go exploring, boys. So yeah, so we're looking pretty pimp in here. And we got Spaghetti Lord four twenty set in sail. We are going to be heading, where is it, oh we're running 60 frames, um, no, 
I don't know which direction we're heading. North. We're heading north, boys. So yeah, so you got any uh, Q and A questions you want to ask? Cause I literally got nothing to do here. Alright, so we got a Dezeburp over here. Let's try to find a, uh, a temple. How about that, boys? I just realized I don't have a crafting table. Yeah, that's probably a bad idea. restored my faith in this live stream. Alright. Uh, we're gonna go hunting. Oh wow, it's turning night and we're actually... Yeah, this is gonna be bad, boys. We're gonna have to run. Hey, found some planes. Looking nice. Is that a savannah? Hey, we found a savannah, boys. Can we get some can we get some hype in the chat for that savannah? Wait, there's bunnies in this? Yo, 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 yo. Hey, we'll get back here. A rabbit hide. Well boys, we just uh we just killed our first rabbit. Yo boy. Is going off. No, I'm not going down there. Yo, what is this? What is this? Gives me instant like hunger. What in tarnation? Is that a village? Oh my god, there's actually a village. Boys, we just found a village. Alright, I gotta kill some of these cows. Here. Oh my god, there's a small zombie. We're literally gonna die here. We're gonna die here. Oh my god, there's two of them. Alright, we got. Desert temple over there. Okay. Come on, we gotta sprint, boys. Uh. Oh my god, no. Well, this is turning out to be a very good episode. Or just, you know, live stream in general. Nice. Got ourselves a temple. So, yeah, if I... If I can't, I'm probably not going to be cutting this up into episodes. So, um... You know, next episode, I'll just have it be... Right away, I'll just go... Hey, you know. <laughs> you didn't catch a live stream. <laughs> that fucking sucks. You should have tuned in. Told everyone. We released a uh, stream announcement so hey sucks to suck man 
Alright, so from what I can remember, there is a pressure plate at the bottom of the temple with a bunch of TNT. Like, you definitely don't want to hit it, because you're going to die if you do. So, that should be incentive enough to not hit it. Start getting that cooking. So, yeah, so it should be... Let's go get this. There better be like golden apples in here. If there's apples in here, I'm actually gonna freak out. Hype up for apples, boys. Fire aspect, a bunch of emeralds. I don't really want rotten flesh. String, gunpowder. Break that. Knock back to gold horse armor. Nice, nice gold ingots. All right, that's a hefty drop there, boys. That's what I like to see. Wow, that restores a lot of hunger. Nice. That's what I like to see. And there's a witch over there. Don't really want to be doing anything with that. never seen one of these villages. Alright, blacksmith. That's what I want. I want to get to the blacksmith. I feel like there's no blacksmith here. Don't look like it'll be a town with a blacksmith. Let's get in here. Alright, go look at the stream. Emeralds do not make green apples. <laughs> Might as well just toss my salad while you're at it. You want me to <laughs> hit it in a la Akbar? <laughs> nah, dude, you're doing good. I don't want to unlock part of that. But yeah, I don't think that there's a blacksmith here. But this is a blacksmith, right? Yeah, a blacksmith. Hmm. I don't see a blacksmith. I think this guy might be lying to me. I'm thinking this guy's lying. Yeah, let's kill some of these sheep. Get ourselves a bed. Oh wait, I can make a bed. I got a. Uh, got wool. Oh god. Just getting attacked from everywhere at once. My game keeps lagging here. It's not not good. Right. Um. Bop bop. And I need wood.
white bed, of course. Let's go, boys. Sweet dreams. Look at that. Look at that. This with me. Hey, we'll come back. task in the game. There we go. Alright, let's turn down video settings. It's messing with them. There we go. Much, much better. Let's keep on killing chickens. How about it? There we go. Got a skeleton here. Oh, we got two skeletons. Alright boys, I'm gonna have to call the stream quits here. Cause I might actually have to go do stuff tomorrow. Um But yeah, this is definitely definitely a good uh episode. Got a, not really an episode, good live stream. Got a lot done. Um, working on my intro for new episodes. Hopefully, I'll have that up um, for next release, um, which I'm thinking the next release will either be a strategy game or Mafia. Um, so, yeah. And sometime I do hope to have a PUBG montage video was my best clips that I got um, so yeah so alright see so yeah, I'm gonna be up ending the uh, ending the live stream here boys so thank you all for sticking around oh hey cool sticking around um, some people have filtered in and out I'd like to give a uh, shout out to especially to uh, Riley and Colin First two viewers, you guys joined almost at the same time. Um, you know, I had oh wow, another another one. Um, had technical difficulties. You guys joined right back. Thank you all for uh for supporting me today. Being you know? These kills are for you boys. So yeah, and I'd like to thank Isaac for you know doing the intro. Uh, I'd like to thank everyone else for tuning in. You know, having a fun time, giving suggestions. Um, so yeah, so after we get this temple done, and two temples. GG. I just realized I didn't get the TNT at the bottom of the other one. So. I just knock at the TNT here. No TNT run. Pop. Alright. I'm literally gonna get stuck here, aren't I? Yep, my pick's broke. You know what? No, I'm not gonna do it. Actually, I got enough stone to come back up. Bop. Almost dead. Keyword almost. Flame. GG. Let's go, boys. 
two golden apples. Two golden apples. What did I say about golden apples? Oh my god. Three golden apples. Gee, gee, boys. Alright. I'm hyped now. Alright. I'm gonna be done with that. Alright, boys. So, uh, I'll talk to you later, and I'll, uh, be catching you on the flip side. Alright. Alright, so, see you later, Gator.